All right, let's begin. Okay. So, first question. Could you describe your hometown for me? Uh, my hometown is Samcho. It's a really small city and it is countryside and it's location for uh, East Korea. Mm -hmm. It's a part of Korea. So, I really like my hometown, but it's too small. So, uh, that don't have a lots of convenience store mm. and but however I'm like a uh, nature mm. okay and what do you like to do when you have some free time <coughs> I'm really like a cartoon especially Japanese cartoon uh, uh, is if I have a free time I just I'm watching cartoon for my Cell phone mm -hmm. is uh, I I know the uh, website, so that time I can see a uh, lots of cartoon. So mm -hmm. I'm enjoy that. Mm. All right, now we're gonna talk about weather. Uh, so what's the weather like where you live? Like <coughs> is I'm really like a sh sun. Is a uh, um, sunny day. I really like it. I work outdoor and time uh, spend the time to outside and feel nature. Mm -hmm. But uh, however, I don't like a cloud day because it can uh, it make a uh, sad and little bit uh, rain is really stressful for me. Mm. Okay. And do you prefer cold or hot weather? I prefer. Hot weather, because it, if cold weather is, uh, I have to wear the lots of clothes. I don't like that situation. Mm -hmm. But in uh, in hot weather, I can take a shower one time. In that time, I'm my temperature is getting uh, better. Mm -hmm. So I really uh, dislike cold weather. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. all right. And do you usually check the weather forecast? Yeah, of course, because weather is uh, really important to my one day life. Mm -hmm. Because uh, if uh, weather is g good, I feel really happy. And uh, I want to go outside and uh, I uh, call my friend and let's go outside together. But however, it's getting uh, it's rain day, I'm really don't want to go outside and I'm just sleep all day. Mm -hmm. So really, this weather is important for me. Mm. Okay. And uh, now we're going to talk about social media. So do you or your friends like using social media? Social media is, now is many people start to YouTube channel. Mm -hmm. Like, and you, in a uh, child, really changes they, their dream is if I uh, ask the child what's your dream is uh, they say uh, YouTube uh, star mm -hmm. like is social media is so is popular in in a day mm -hmm. so and my friend and some of my friends start to uh, YouTube channel and some people every day upload the Instagram mm -hmm. then uh, they share the, their life so I think it's uh, now it is uh, like social media is really important in our life mm. for. and do you think some of your friends use social media too much yeah I I'm already told you is uh, my some of my friend is upload Instagram every day and they share the all uh, their life but if I'm not uh, tech talk to them uh, sorry I see if I see a death story and I'm, I'm not talked uh, some message they call me why you don't tag me why uh, so why I have to see how you live so but really some people is important that so I don't like that situation really. All right, perfect. 
That will do us for part one. So now let's go on to part two of the test. So here is your question. Yeah, and there's a pencil. So you can take notes here. So I'll give you one minute for note taking. All right. All right, mate, that's one minute. So could you describe the home of someone you know well and that you often visit? Okay, I'm <coughs> talking my friend house. It's a uh, I'm now I'm living in Suwon is and my friend house is near my house and we are best friend we met uh, when I was a university student and now we are really close friend and uh, so <coughs> sometime we uh, is uh, I'm visit my uh, my friend house uh, for three times a, a week because like we eat dinner together or drink together because we don't have a close friend in the near the our house because uh, now uh, we are university is uh, in the Busan so or or we are close friend is living in Busan so we just close friend uh, is we're only friend in the that area, so and now is we can make a new friend because it's pandemic is make that. So now I'm, but we really like uh, that situation because we are so close friend. We talk lots of time, and uh, if I visit the, his house, I'm really comfortable and fun and happy because uh, sometimes I feel lonely, but if I drink with uh, him and we share the, our life and give us some, sometimes give advice and sometimes we uh, uh, share the funny story. So that time we, I, I get uh, energy. So I, I can do lots of things in tom tomorrow and do that. Okay, mate, that's two minutes. All right. Have you guys met recently? Yeah, I'm really like him, mm -hmm. and we're hobby is same. Uh, like, uh, I don't like a game. So, if we meet uh, together, we do a bowling mm -hmm. or pocket ball. Mm. Yeah, so we're same hub have a same hobby. So, that time really we we enjoyed uh, that game. Nice man. All right, we'll go on to the third part of the test now. We're almost there. All right. Mm. What are the differences between buildings in the city and buildings in the countryside? Uh, it, it's different uh, is how many buildings in the, that area. Is uh, <coughs> in con for example, in a city, many buildings in small area and really beating is high mm -hmm. so many people live in there and many people uh, um, want to live in there that small area and but however it's countryside is a a few uh, beating in uh, that area and it's not high mm -hmm. because really small people live in that area so they don't need to build a high 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 building mm. so that is really is population is different mm, right and do you think young people prefer to live in large cities or in rural areas i think it's rural area is don't have a lots of uh a building and uh, like I think it's a big city is a more have a um, lots of activity and uh, lots of friend so I'm really like a living city because that time I get a really many job and a good job and uh, get a many people uh, my many friend I can make a lots of friend so 
I think it's younger people and ex uh, education is more uh, good to city. Mm -hmm. So I think it's, uh, it's many people want to live in big city. Okay, yes. Um, um, what do you think are the advantages of living in the countryside? Countryside? Mm. Actually, my home, hometown is a really small home, uh, countryside. Uh, so, that time, I, if I visit the, my hometown, mm -hmm. I feel really happy because no many people and fresh, uh, free air, air, like nature is so good. Mm -hmm. So, that time, uh, and we, uh, my hometown have a sea, a beach, so that time really this beach is so clean and so I'm really relaxed and different. Mm. So I think it's uh, like sometimes it's a city and uh, have a like travel jam and many people get lots of stress. Mm. So many people want to uh, travel for countryside. Mm. So that is really Good. Right. Okay. And do you think it's expensive to decorate a house or an apartment in your country? Yeah, it's, it is really in, it's expensive because and now is a uh, technology is getting good. Mm -hmm. So almost is a te uh, technology connect the cell phone so that time we turn off the uh, tech uh, is everything is in for cell phone mm -hmm. so that is is price is more getting high so i think is uh, later is uh, many decorate uh, if i decorate my room i'm almost uh technology <laughs> is last of thing is connect uh, my phone and mm. that is really expensive mm. so i'm really worried about that mm -hmm. okay yeah and what do you think people consider the most important thing about their home is it i think is the uh, most important of my home is kitchen now my father make um, our home that time we really this <coughs> really long time described uh, how to make a kitchen mm -hmm. like color and how uh, what kind of is things come to kitchen mm -hmm. and how to using that kitchen and sometime uh, my younger brother say I want to make a bar <laughs> like mm -hmm. so that that time yeah is uh, really feel funny and if someone visit my house they really surprise that so mm. i think is also is uh, eating place is kitchen so is it is really important to our life sure. so it's uh, like how to <coughs> consider the that kitchen is really important to our life mm. i think all right then that's us mate we're finished Score might be a bit lower though, might be like 4.5 today, a bit lower than you expected I think. But there's a couple of things you just need to improve, right? A lot of positives as well, you're very fluent, you know, there's no hesitation. You answered all the questions quite well with just a few exceptions. But yeah, strong point is definitely your fluency. Um, but the other side, we need to work on the grammar, we know that. Y yeah, you know that yourself, yeah. yeah. Like just uh, uh, subject verb agreements sometimes, like the basic ones, you know, we need to study them and be a little bit tighter, you know. Uh, for example, a, a common one that you were saying, like, I'm really like blah, blah, blah. So I'm really like hot weather. So, you know, yourself, I really like hot weather. Yeah, so make sure we have no, no form of to be there. So I really like hot weather. Um, like, for example, yeah. don't and doesn't, they don't, he mm, doesn't, right. D these things need uh -huh. to be a little bit tighter, yeah. Um, what else have we got? 
if I have a free time, make sure there's no A there, just free time. Free. That's a common one. Um, other things we're looking at here, plurals as well. The, you are not adding the S to a lot of your um, a lot of your sentences. You were saying like, for example, three time a week, three times a week. Mm. Yeah, sometime, sometimes. I don't like game. I don't mm. like games. Mm. Yeah, so plural would be one thing, you know, subject verb would be another thing. So grammar needs to be a little bit tighter. Yeah, a little bit tighter. Uh, vocab, any issues with vocab? One was like, you said pocketball. Uh, I know you use that word in Korean. I think in English it's better to say pool. pool. Yeah, P-O-O-L. Yeah, so you pay, pool. play pool with your friend. Uh, another word, when you said small people, it shouldn't be small. What should it be? A few. Few people. Few people. Yeah, the countryside is few people. Few people in there, yeah. Um, and just be careful with some of the questions, you know. In part one I said, what, what's the weather like? where you live, mm -hmm. so uh, you should describe the weather uh, in your hometown rather than the weather that you like, right? So just be careful with that. Um, and there was another one in part one as well when we were talking about, um, yeah, there's another one about social media. So just make sure the question was about, do you think you or your friends use it too much? And you started talking about like children mm -hmm. in general. So make sure and listen to the subject of the question. Um, also in uh, part three, in part three, many of your answers, you were talking about your situation. But uh -huh. you know, part three should be more general, like people in your country. So really be careful in part three. I think, for example, like the last one, like what do people consider important? And you said like, oh, I think kitchen is important. So uh -huh. make sure you, you uh, focus on the subject of the question. So yeah, I'd say your score is probably around 4.5. It, it could even go up to five, I would say, but it's just because of the part mm -hmm. threes. I think if they were answered a bit better then maybe. But uh, yeah, a lot of positives, but we know grammar needs to be tighter. Yeah, yeah you know yourself, man. All right. Lewis, thank yeah, you. Thank you. Thank you.